Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you step-by-step -step how to create and use custom UDP config files for your VPN. This will help you secure and speed up your internet browsing. Let's get started. Step 1. Search for the custom UDP site. First, open your browser and search for custom UDP site. Click on the official website for the custom UDP service. Make sure you're on the right page. Step 2. Open the menu. Once you're on the home page of the site, look for the menu icon. It's usually represented by three horizontal lines in the top corner. Click on that to open the menu. Step 3. Choose 30 days UDP custom configs. In the menu options, click on the 30 days UDP custom configs link. This will bring you to a page with various configuration files that you can download. Step 4. Download the config file. Take a look through the available options and choose the config file that suits your needs. Once you've picked one, simply click to download it to your device. Step 5. Install the HTTP Custom VPN app. Next, head over to your App Store, whether that's the Play Store or App Store, and search for HTTP Custom VPN. Download and install the app on your device. Step 6. Import the config file into the app now. Open up the HTTP Custom VPN app. Inside the app, you should see an option to add a new configuration. Tap the plus sign or the import option, and then locate the config file you downloaded earlier. Select it to import into the app. Step 7. Connect to the VPN. Once the config file is imported, you're almost there. Simply tap the connect button in the app to establish the VPN connection. You'll now be able to enjoy secure and fast browsing for the next 30 days. Conclusion? That's it. You've now set up a custom UDP VPN configuration and are ready to browse securely and with improved speed. If you need any help or have questions, don't forget to join our Telegram and WhatsApp channels. The links are in the description. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button for more tutorials and leave a comment below if something was unclear or if you need further assistance. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.